Hey there, it is Mitchell, and in today's video, I just want to go over MIUI 10 on the Xiaomi Mi Pad 4. And I want to go into some of the new features and some of the overall performance. If you guys are new to my channel, I make videos about the tech I use, camera gear, tablets, and overall just kind of the technology that I use and interface with, along with an occasional Adobe Premiere or Adobe Lightroom tutorial. So the first feature that I want to cover in the new MIUI 10 update for the Mi Pad 4 is going to be the introduction of gestures into MIUI 10. So these are the gestures. You swipe up from the bottom and hold the app to go ahead and get to this new multitasking card layout where if you long press and hold on some of the cards you can do various things like launching into app info locking an application open or going into split screen mode it's really really nice and fluid experience overall uh, using the gestures the next gesture is the back gesture, which is a simple swipe from the screen. And you can also use this swiping from one side of the screen to move into the next application, like a quick app switching mode of sorts. But you swipe, you hold the swipe, and then it jumps to the next most recent app. Really cool take on multitasking, and I actually somewhat enjoy it in MIUI 10. The next is the new notification slider panel area uh, that's got the new brightness slider along with some new and various control layouts. You can go from gesture mode to button mode directly. The next really cool thing that they've done in MIUI 10 is to go ahead and give you Android Pie like volume controls. And the th reason I think this is really cool is because the new volume controls that are coming to uh, Android Pie would, under other circumstances, be a new feature or something that's disturbing the overall user experience of MIUI. And as you can see with the new volume sliders in the Android P style, uh, it, they've already kind of addressed that with a MIUI update so that users will not have to be aware of the new uh, update in Android Pie. Now another feature that's been recently introduced into MIUI 10, which I did not see prior, was the AI preloading, which increases the speed and overall responsiveness that the device has by using machine learning to predict the apps that you're going to open. And I gotta say, guys, the applications on this device load extremely fast, equally as fast as they do on my Mi A2. Another interesting thing that I noticed with this new MIUI 10 update, or it could just be that I'm running the Xiaomi EU ROM of it, is support for OK Google. As you can see, it will go ahead and activate it along with the Google Assistant. And overall, I'm really happy with the responsiveness of how this device is. Now, to really quickly touch on the performance increase of MIUI 10 on the Mi Pad 4, I really got to say that the performance, uh, the, the the performance is just really, really really improved and it's in a lot of just kind of screen animations and uh, fluid app movements and just kind of things along those lines that I've noticed a really big improvement uh, no longer am I getting the missed notifications from apps as I was in MIUI 9 and it's overall been a really welcome uh, I guess jump in performance as well as just overall device uh, optimization. Uh, obviously some of that is the fact that I am running the Xiaomi EU ROM, but the features that are present and available in this ROM are still going to be present and available in all of MIUI 10. Okay, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Sorry it was such a ramble. Till next time, it's been Mitchell coming to you from Hanoi. Peace.